since we have HD video of it, we played at the start of the broadcast today. But Joe, tell folks about flying out from Austin yesterday. Oh yeah, and it, I wanted to throw up. I hate going through that process. But the funniest part here, funniest part. All right, so I'm walking up to the TSA checkpoint area, and uh, I look at the uh, the gentleman there, and I said, "Hey, uh, I would like to opt out and go through the pat down process." And the lady walks over from the machine. She goes, "Oh, oh, sir, don't don't worry about it. There's no." Look, look at the sign. It says no radiation. Just come on through. It's better. Come on. Just come on through. And I said, no, I'm not going through that. She goes, look at the sign. It says there's no radiation, though. And I said, well, how do I know? That's the same machine I saw here the other week when I flew out. The only thing that's different is now you have a sign that says there's no radiation. That doesn't make me feel any better. Well, what about you know? them so saving the naked image? And by the way, there is radiation. Yeah, you know, they, they, they just, they've lied. And then I went through, and the guy's sitting there, and I said, well, what, what does this do? You patting me down and harassing me and as an American citizen, what does this do to secure our borders? And uh, he was like, uh, 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 you know, and stuttered, didn't really know what to say. And then I said, well, what, is there is there truth to the fact that you guys are letting, you know, these undocumented uh, legals fly for ID? And he said, no, 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 that that, that doesn't happen at all. But we know it does. We've seen the reports. We have the video. It's admitted. We have their own internal documents ordering them to do it. Yeah, and the guy was just bold face lying. Everybody in that entire TSA organization, they're a bunch of psyop liars. I mean, they, 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 they've they sat down. They've been briefed for hours and hours. They know how to run their little game and, you know, spew forth their propaganda just to make the, uh, the unawake person just ready to jump through that little machine and, you know, just get radiation and get cancer and die. They want us all to die off. So the fact that we are evil, meanwhile, we harass hard working American citizens who pay into the system and then aren't getting health care they deserve, and vets are dying. You know, what is it? What has this country gone to? Well, I mean, what are these people doing? Well, sure. First, they said a few months ago that, oh, uh, you know, it's only in Arizona that there's secret list where we deny health care to people and let them die, veterans at the VA. Then, of course, it was at every major VA. And then it was, well, it was a mistake we didn't know. Then the New York Times comes out and goes, no, there are death panels. We can't take care of everybody. This idea that they're going to decide who to give care to, that's why you don't want socialist care, because it always becomes a rationing, folks. It doesn't work. Someone from Juarez right now comes into our country with a weapon in their truck. You know what's going to happen? Oh, hey, uh, excuse me, sir. Can you come over here? Uh, there's a, a hospital over here. You look like you're parched. We'll get you some water, give you an IV. And uh, if you want, sign up for some education. Meanwhile, if our Marine goes across into Mexico and makes the wrong turn, he's being held in jail for five months. And our government's doing nothing about it. Well, why are they being so racist and mean in Mexico? I mean, why don't they, you know... Let him go. They, will want us to, they want us to take all their garbage, but they can't, you know, do anything to help us out with this guy. This guy's been stuck over there, Sergeant Morrissey, for five months now. I know, it's because the American people it. are a joke. That's, I that's, mean, that's, we put up with anything. That's one less threat for them to worry about. That's one less threat. That's why returning vets and veterans are enemies of the state now. He, that's one less that they've got to worry about. That's one less trained Marine that they know can stand up and fight that tyranny. That's why they let the veterans die, because they know they don't have the ability to fight back when they start getting sick and they aren't being seen. This is all a planned, orchestrated attack on us by the Obama administration and the elites that run this entire world. This is crazy. Joe, how many times have you been to the Austin VA in the six months you've been here? How, how many times? Five times. Five times, and I haven't had one actual appointment where they do anything for me. All I do is I sit down, I see a new doctor, and I have to retell my story about what's going on, show them my metal do uh, medical documents, and then they're like, all right, we're going to schedule for another appointment. Well, then that gets scratched, they cancel it, and then I'm back to the uh, This Skype's breaking up because of the heat out there, uh, but uh, you know, he coughs up blood at night, he has to have black sheets because of the blood everywhere, and uh, he's got you know his knees out, he's got shrapnel in his foot. Uh, and uh, shrapnel, and he can't get medical care, so he has to go you know, and get private insurance and take care of it that way. Uh, and we do have him back. So you're saying five times you've gone, and then each time they just send you to another appointment. Yeah, they send me to another appointment. I have to explain my whole situation over again. You know, I've, I've done so many MRIs. 
And every time they come back, Alex, and they go, hey, you know, you have a complete severed ACL in your right knee. That's bad. How long has this been? I said, since 2006. They're like, wow, that's crazy. They haven't tried to do surgery yet? I'm like, well, I've been trying since 2006. And you're like the 50th doctor over my, since 2006, you know, from the, the Dorn VA, the Army, wherever I've been, where they just completely keep dragging me around, jerking me around, and not getting to the issue at hand. Well, well you're, you're undoubtedly on their no treatment list. Oh, obviously, because every time I try to go in, they just want to give me more drugs. Well, why don't you take these pills real quick? That'll help you. I was like, well, there's not a pill in the world that's going to help rebuild my ACL that's been completely severed. Stop Unbelievable. Stop shutting drugs down my throat. Stop trying to make me go insane. And I, I, I'm sick of it. I'm sick of being treated like a guinea pig, like some lab rat. Well, all I'm these people that claim like they support... American I hear you. All these people that claim they support our troops, they better actually start supporting them and getting them real health care. Joe Biggs, you're going to follow some more reports. Great job. Get out there and get it covered. Call's coming up. This hour brought to you by InfidelBodyArmor.com. When it hits the fan, don't be left without the body armor that will save your life. With prices starting at just $374.99 and ships free. Get yours at InfidelBodyArmor.com. Just won't quit. Hi, Ted Anderson with Midas Resources. Is it time to convert paper 401ks and IRAs to solid gold and silver yet? Get our 10 Reasons book free. Call 800-686-2237. That's 800-686-2237. My Magic Mud is a tooth whitening powder that removes plaque and detoxifies your mouth. It's safe for your enamel, giving you a beautiful polish and a dentist light clean after every use. My Magic Mud is also the perfect remedy for pain caused by sensitivity. It strengthens your teeth and gums for a strong, healthy smile. The ingredients are 100% natural and it's safe for children. Simply brush with My Magic Mud right before bedtime for a cleaning you can count on. Visit MyMagicMud.com. Open your eyes. It's time to give your eyes a powerful nutritional boost. Sight is the primary input to the brain, arguably making eyesight the most important sense we have. And just like the other important organs in our bodies, our eyes function at peak levels when they are fed the proper amounts of essential nutrition. Open your eyes. Combining key ingredients like vitamin A, zinc, lutein, proprietary saffron bulb extracts, and more, OccuPower by InfoWars. Wars Life is a new formulation specifically designed to nutritionally assist the natural function of healthy eyes. Optimize the natural power of your eyes with the latest addition to the super high quality InfoWars Life formulations, OccuPower. Go to InfoWarsLife.com or InfoWarsStore.com to order OccuPower or call 1-888-253-3139. OccuPower, open your eyes. Question. Could too many GMO foods and toxins be overloading your digestive and immune systems? Answer, yes. If you're searching for a powerful detox that's gentle enough to use every day, use Pro-EM-1 from Terraganics. Pro-EM-1 is a powerful liquid probiotic that uses good bacteria to suppress pathogens and gently eliminate toxins from your body. A healthy digestive system will cleanse and remove toxins, support weight loss, improve absorption of food nutrients, and aid in controlling yeast and other infections. Pro-EM-1 is made with only non-GMO and certified organic ingredients, has no preservatives, and is dairy, soy, wheat, and gluten-free. Pro-EM-1 is the key to your digestive health. Order Pro-EM-1 Daily Probiotic Cleanse at Terraganics.com, spelled T-E-R-A-G-A-N-I-X.com, or call toll-free 866-369-3678. That's 866-369-3678. Also available through Amazon Prime. Pro-EM-1 from Terraganics. Life's getting better. Judy, we're going to go back to Trey here in a moment. Open phones coming up in the third hour. Also, we found an amazing video that hasn't even gone viral yet of police wanting to go door to door without warrants looking for a felon and a man basically uh, constitutionally standing up against it. It's very informative. I'm going to play that at the bottom of the hour and post it to Infowars.com and PrisonPlanet.com here in the next 10 minutes. We'll also tweet it out at Real Alex Jones. Please don't forget this hour is brought to you by MyPatriotSupply.com, MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex. The super high quality, non-GMO, very inexpensive, uh, with a proprietary packaging system that makes them very portable, 
MyPatriotsApply.com forward slash Alex to find their specials. Or 866-229-0927. In my view, everybody needs storable foods. This is the place to get it. MyPatriotsApply.com forward slash Alex. We also carry their full line of food at InfoWarsStore.com. Whatever you do, MyPatriotsApply.com. Now, the caller, it was so epic last night. I hadn't been to Barton Springs but a few times this summer, so I thought I'd go to Barton Springs last night, this big, giant, spring-fed pool on the side of the Colorado River. There was almost nobody there. There were all these bats flying around right at sunset over the water, huge, big pink clouds. And over the little damn spillway, there was just a bunch of people that sounded like demons yelling and screaming and laughing and starting fights, yelling at, at, at people over the fence who would paid three bucks to get into Barton Springs proper. And they sounded and looked like Charlie Manson's, but they were beyond schizophrenics. It looked like they were a, a group of men, some of them middle-aged, one of them older, just basically saying they would, that they would kill people. Ha, ah, look at you, old man. They'd see people walk around in their swimsuits and make fun of them, trying to get a rise. And... Finally, as they were threatening people, the police were called. And I thought about every time I'm at Barton Springs, the police are over there writing tickets for people's dogs off a leash in the area that's where the spillway of the springs come out where you don't have to pay. And a lot of nice folks are over there. But there's also a lot of trashy people. And at an instinctive level for about 30 minutes while the sun's setting, I just heard the, the, the voices and, and the meanness and the, them taunting people until they were told the police had been called and they all laughed and left. But it was weird. I was there with some of my friends and they said, look, just look at the sun setting and the moon coming up. Look at that. That's, that's good. That's God's creation. That's heaven. This way is hell. And you could see towards the Colorado, the city, the evil city and the night and these people yelling and screaming and saying horrible things as the beautiful moon came up and the sun set, and it was just an archetype of which way do you want to go. And without people even saying on both sides of Barton Springs, everyone just turned their backs on these people and looked at the sunset and the moonrise. And I walked up about 200 yards, and probably 60% of the people I saw there, when I say it wasn't busy, there were probably 100 people there instead of 1,000 like there are at peak times or more. They were all, hey, Alex, appreciate what you're doing. Appreciate what your work, you know, just turn your back on them. Just don't look at them. And it was like the spiritual moment as everyone turned their backs on these people as they yelled for 25 minutes and they were back in the distance and they screamed even louder with their hands on the chain link fence like literal demons going, look at you, old man. You're going to die, old man. Look at your Speedos and your little such and such. I'd like to kill you. Yeah, come over here and do something, old man. Come over and, and And as a man, I wanted to climb over there and literally, you know, Conan the Barbarian, at an instinctive level, tribally, 5,000 years ago, we'd have got together as men and gone over there and dealt with them. But see, now we're domesticated, so we call the police to come do it. But see, they were literally like bad guys out of the Road Warrior. That's what these guys were like, just truly evil. But we all turned our backs on them. We have to do that to the globalist. We have to fight them, speak out this against them, but also remove our consent at a spiritual network. level. Separate ourselves from them. I began to get into iodine a few years ago because it was helping me and my family so much get healthy and detoxify. Most people know that iodine deficiency has been a crisis around the world. Iodine is key to so many of the body's functions, especially the thyroid. I discovered a product being developed by Dr. Group. You now know it as Survival Shield True Nascent Iodine that your body can really absorb. Then, about a year ago, he said, listen, if you think this is powerful, I'm going to come out with rare earth, deep earth crystals. And the results that I personally have had have been life-changing. Nobody else has got iodine based on these pure crystals, ladies and gentlemen. This is innovating, and the best part is it helps fund InfoWars.com, the radio show, the TV show, the whole media operation promoting true libertarian ideas. For a limited time, experience the ancient power of Survival Shield X2. Take advantage of this unprecedented 30% off Super Detox Special at InfoWarsLife.com. 
Waging war on corruption. Alex Jones on the GCM Radio Network.